Hello everyone, welcome back to SK CAD Solution. Today I am going to show you how to prepare Universal Giant in Autodesk Inventor software. You can see the assembly drawing and 2D drawings including BOM. In this there are 5 parts. First I will start 2D drawing, then I will start assembly. Friends, if you are new to my channel, please do subscribe my channel and support me. Here select metric template, standard mm, create. Select extrude, select the plane, create on center rectangle, give the dimension 90, press tab 60 mm. So finish sketch, thickness is 15 mm. Select this face, sketch, sorry edit, edit face, select this face, sketch, select the circle, create on dia 46 circle, give the dimension 50 mm. Give the vertical constraint, select line, trim, trim this circle, select circle again, create dia 16 circle. Finish sketch, extrude, reverse the direction, 15 mm is ok, extrude, select mirror, mirror about center plane, select this surface sketch, create one more circle. Dia 30, select line or select rectangle, give the dimensions 18 mm, this is 8 mm, 4, trim entities, Trim these lines, finish sketch, extrude 30 mm, so front view, that's it, assign the material here, steel, Select here stainless steel. You can assign some good finishes here. Steel polished. So, if you want, you can change the polishes. Select entire body. So, you can assign color like this also if you require. Save the part, The first part is driving oak, driving and driven is both same.
so save as so you can edit this color for this driven yolk so next part is bearing cross same template open this is the bearing cross select print plane select xz plane circle dia 30 create one more circle dia 16 so finish sketch extrude symmetric length we required 60 mm plane sketch circle 30 16 give the dimension from here to here 23 mm So give the concern here. Finish sketch. Symmetric sixty mm is okay. Select here pilot. Select this edge. Give the dimension five mm. Okay. assign material steel control s bearing cross so if you want you can change this color it is very dark dull is their color so control new control n for next part is bolt can see this is the bolt select your project geometry select this select this and convert this as a center line give the dimensions this outer die is 24 mm this is 16 mm overall length is 113 this length is 8 mm so give the vertical concern here finish sketch revolve okay select the chamfer 
give the dimension 0.5 mm select this and this edge if you want you can increase 1 mm is ok next there is a one hole diameter 4 mm plane sketch select here slice graphics create one hole here 4 mm dimension from here to here 94 mm give the horizontal constraint finish catch extrude cut both side diameter 20 ok assign material Save the part as a bolt. Control in. Next part is bush. Create. Here select two circles. Outer diameter is 24 mm. Friends, if you require any drawing. ISO drawing you can leave the comment below with your details whatsapp number or gmail I will definitely send you this thickness is 8 mm sketch Slice graphics 4 mm finish catch symmetric remove material give the diameter 25 mm save the part bush here you can assign some different material or go with same material you can assign material as per your requirements friends you can see all the materials here Control in next part is pin create on circle dia four finish catch extrude symmetric pin length is thirty mm select chamfer zero point five mm select the edges ok so control in now you can go to assembly in the metric you can see there is a assembly template standard mm So first place the components Select view change it into shaded with edges So first we need to constrain this Constraint 
here you can see there is a planes select this plane and this surface apply select this plane and this plane apply select this plane and this plane apply so now this part is won't move because it has constraint inside the next component with the constraint so this we can give it later this is not coming like this take the another part bearing cross constraint for constraint you can press c also shortcut so it will move like this and up and down also that's what called universal joint inside the components bush bolt and pin take first bush apply select this surface and this apply this circle and this apply this and this apply apply give the tangent condition here change the dimension again so no, no need to take again we can drag this directly so you can confirm with the drawing all the parts are added and assembled as per the drawing so that's the today session friends i hope you enjoy this session and also i am requesting everyone please do subscribe my channel and support me thanks for watching this session friends